silence is your true nature. That's why you are so much struggling to get back to it. That's why you take medications. That's why you numb yourself. That's why you drink, you smoke, you eat sugar, you have sex, you buy cars, homes, you accumulate more things, you're hanging on your stuff because you want peace. You want peace, and peace only comes from silence, but you're not aware of that. You think it's in something. It's in somewhere, or it's in somebody. Somebody, your saint, your priest, the people you worship, they can give it to you. You don't know it's inside yourself because you never looked. No one ever told you that. Because there's no marketing value in it. Who's going to get rich by telling you that? Your deep attraction to peace is because it's silent and it's quiet. All this nagging, all these desires, all this stuff that, oh, I really need to be with somebody in this life and I don't have my soulmate or I'm damaged and I've been wronged and da 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 and blah 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 da 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 if you go beyond these things you fall back into ultimate peace you tap into the ultimate love you tap into something far 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 beyond the nagging of your mind And the little joy that you get from emotions when things go your way and the little satisfaction you get from it, this is beyond all of it. You can't give that up for a little instant gratification that you get. You can't be that ignorant. Not at this point. You got to go for it. It's in front of you. It requires you to take one more jump, one more step. You're on the edges of it. We have been together for six days. You're feeling it. You're feeling it. You've been in ecstasy. You've been in this place of something has happened. Something has touched you. Something has changed you. There is an ecstasy. There is a bliss. There's something that is of value that you're feeling it in this moment in your heart. I know you're feeling it. I know it. Take the last step. Don't deviate from it. What do you have to lose that you're not going to lose anyway? Take the final jump. Dive into silence.
and then you will see that your mind, your thoughts, your story of your past, everything was designed, all your emotional damages or whatever, traumas, they were all designed to bring you to this point. And none of them really happened to you. It happened to an imaginary character that you thought it was you. It was never you. Because you are silence. And you can't damage silence. It's always here. Everything comes from silence. Everything goes back to silence. Look at what's going on right now. They're forcing you to wear a mask. It can't be any more symbolic than that. It means be quiet. Be silent. What happens when the baby's born? It starts with a cry. And what happens? Where was it before? It comes from silence. It was quiet. And then what happens after you die? They either burn you or put you under the ground, but it goes back into silence. And any time in your life that you've been happy is because your mind was silent. Recognize that. It's in front of you. Embrace it. Bring your attention to it. And you see you're instantly free. You will see that you've never suffered. And you would never ever suffer no matter what happens. Suffering will end in your life. Because everything else is a noise. Recognize silence and you will see your complaints are just noises. That's what they are, noises in your head. A dual personality, two people in your head talking to each other. You should have not done this. Well, but I did. You idiot. Why did you go and invest your money? Da -da -da -da. Well, because da 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 da. When you do something, before you do it, this, this one is telling you, you should be doing this, you should be doing that, you da, 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 da. you're lonely, you don't have a man, you don't have a lover, you don't la 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 la. Then you go to do things according to this one, and it fails. And then what do you do? The same voice starts telling you, you're so stupid, you're an idiot, you never learn. You always make the same mistake. Who tells you that you're ugly? Who tells you that you're not good enough? Who tells you that you're fat? Who tells you that you're short? Who tells you that you're not smart? Maybe when you were five, six, seven, eight years old, your dad, your mom, your peers told you that. But who's telling you these things at your age now? It's this voice you're hearing it. And you buy it. You have to be smarter than that. Because you are smarter than that. You can't buy this thing. This thing appears on silence and goes back into silence. It's not real.